Hi, my name is Elias and I'm from Farah Chocolate. Today I'm going to present you some of our blasting heads. As you already know, we have two types of sand blasting systems. One type is an injection system and the other is pressure sand blasting system. We have four different guns for injection sand blasting systems. This one is called SX35 and it's used for very precise sand blasting. This one is called ENH and we use it in cameras. This one is practically the same, it's called Anigun, we also use it in cabins. The difference is that we trigger this gun with this trigger and the ENH gun is triggered with this foot pedal. The most common gun that we use is power gun. As you can see, it's very easy to assemble or disassemble. It's assembled with a plastic nozzle pre nozzle and air nozzle. The difference is that this power gun, the smallest nozzle that you use with this gun, it's 8, eight mm of diameter here. And the uh, air supply goes here and it creates vacuum and it sucks media through this hose and the mixture of the media and the air supply goes through the nozzle and you can start blasting. Here we have pressure sand blasting hose, which is actually a nozzle holder attached to the sand blasting hose. And on the other end you have a coupling which is attached to the dosing valve. The coupling can be plastic or metal, it's a different type. If you want to start blasting, you have this dead man switch which is also attached to the and plastic goes, it's bigger like this. Here we can change a different variety of nozzles. We have special types of nozzles. The Turing nozzle, regular nozzle, or a nozzle like this, for example, that we use for boiler sand plastic. Window in the cabin is assembled from two types of glasses. Regular glass and plexiglass. On the inside, we have a regular glass, and uh, when it gets blasted, we can change it. But in case that the regular glass will break, we also have plexiglass on the outside of the cabin to protect the operator. We have different types and sizes of filter cartridges that we use in our filter units. This one, for example, is a cylinder. We can also have polyester or Kevlar or HEPA filter or something like that. Filter cartridges should be cleaned with air after two, two, uh, 200 hours of working time and they should be changed in 1000 hours of working time. Now I'm going to show you the gear for sand blasting. This is a heavy duty overall with leather to protect the operator and the sand blasting helmet. But for that matter we need to have breathing air filter which supplies fresh air into the sand blasting helmet. And of course, we cannot forget rubber gloves to protect our hands. For safety and quality sandblasting, we recommend you to use our safety gear and our quality spare parts.